Happening tonight, the City of Montgomery's Violence Prevention Group is organizing a special event for families and victims affected by gun violence. WSFA 12 News reporter Monet Stevens is joining us live at Montgomery City Hall where the event will take place. Monet? Well, Mark, as you know, the month of June is Gun Violence Awareness Month, and the number of people who die by gun violence each year keeps adding up. And joining me right now is the Office of Violence Prevention Director, Keith Moore. And, you know, Keith, talk to us just about why tonight is so important. Tonight is so important because we as the city of Montgomery uh, understand uh, and care for those who have lost someone to a senseless crime such as gun violence. And so we're coming together as the city and the families of Montgomery Montgomery to show that we care about those who are having to deal with the loss of a loved one. And so you work constantly with the victims of gun violence and their families. Um, talk to us just about have you guys started to see an increase of more and more families coming to you guys this year? We're beginning to build out better and begin to serve our community and our families a lot more often. So we reach out to them. Uh, we're there for funeral services and things like that, doing our best to support them as they see need. Of course, it's a very sensitive time and some people just want to do it just with their family. But as much as we're allowed, we, we try to be there to support families and this balloon release comes at a time where we're you know the community is reeling from a triple homicide that just happened uh, a couple of days ago and I know the Hispanic community will be here in numbers tonight uh, how would you want to show support for that community who lost a, a friend a father and a, a sibling well we want to show support for the Hispanic community the African American community the Caucasian community we want to be a support to everyone we understand that this is a very sensitive time uh, but they are the citizens of Montgomery and our mayor our city council, our county, is in support of all the citizens of Montgomery. We want to be sure that we're here and we address those things that are affecting that particular segment of our community. Absolutely. And the community at large is desperate for answers and desperate for solutions to prevent violence. How are you guys trying to support those people who are really wanting to help our community? We're continuing to build out those relationships with community-based organizations, faith-based organizations, and all those who are concerned about curbing violence. It's enough to talk about it, but we're out here doing the work. And so we're here to work with our young people to get uh, credible messengers on the street to make sure that we can start to turn uh, some of the attitudes that are in the streets that are that is causing um, the lack of conflict resolution to occur in our city and with young, young individuals and young folks. And so we're working uh, diligently every day to put in not just uh, individual sol solutions, but programmatic solutions that will cause us to have a long-term and lasting effect. Absolutely. Thank you so much again, Keith. And once again, this balloon release will take place here at City Hall at 530. And of course, wear your orange if you plan on attending. Monet, thanks for that. Again, the event is scheduled 530 and we'll be checking in with Monet during WSFA 12 News at 5.